is your last chance to get an early taste of spring at the annual Rooms of Blooms Floral Show. Pauline spent some time at the Paint Art Center and Gardens in Oshkosh to check it out. Well, good morning, everyone. I'm here with event manager here at the Paint, Michelle. Uh, Rooms of Blooms is pretty much everywhere, including the hallways. It is. It's hundreds of floral arrangements through all of the rooms of the mansion, mm -hmm. really reinterpreted through floral design. This beautiful painting that was recently um, added to our collection is really been done um, a very nice job of reinterpretation by Sterling Gardens out of Nina. And just on the hall here, who do we have in that basket? Well, that's um, Ladybug Floral and Gifts out of Berlin, mm -hmm. and they use two very beautiful um, French and um, Impressionist paintings to um, reinterpret the duo with a beautiful basket of flowers. You could almost imagine being in either of those scenes <laughs> on a countryside picking out a basket of flowers. So as we said, flowers are everywhere, not just the hallways. We have rooms as well. Tell me about the library room. Well, the library was reinterpreted by um, Harnix Floral and Gifts. And they were certainly inspired by the rich textures of the room to do some beautiful orchids, birds of paradise, and um, other flowers to really pay tribute and bring out all of beauty in this room. It's just a really great way to be creative. Of it course. is. Oh, florists love it because there's a lot of creativity that they can do by being given a room or a painting to then be re-inspired by and show people the breadth and depth of their work mm -hmm. rather than just getting a phone call saying, hey, I need a vase of flowers. This is, hey, I can do all kinds of great things. So now on Sunday, when can people come in? It's the last day. Sunday will be the last day of spring and that we brought to the region a little early. <laughs> 11 to 4 are our hours, and we'd love for you to come and take a visit to Rooms of Blooms. All right. Thanks, Michelle. Thank you.